there's a war going on in my head. I wrestle with thoughts all day. The inside of my mind is an MMA boxing ring and my bad ideas are better fighters than I'd ever thought they'd be. With every match they win, the temptation that starts in my heart plays out in the theater of my mind like a musical. My thoughts become starving artists that want me to perform the stupid things I'm thinking. See, in this riot where our daydreams peer pressure our actual actions, we're not safe. Because if my thought life came to life, then that life would feed the prison pipeline. A wild west outlaw that takes my focus, kidnaps it, and kills my good intent without regret. And like every witness to a murder, I'm scared to say anything about it out loud, but up here, I am fighting a, a, a losing battle. It's like, it's like there's a me inside my head that I don't want to be. A, a, a little me that makes me feel the same way mothers do when their kids act up in school. A me that embarrasses me, that it's upset, that's crazy, that takes every good thing and twists it until the only thing that remains are the remnants of... Hold on, hold on, hold on. You just gonna diss me like that in front of all these people? I'm sorry, who, yo, who was that talking? <sighs> Who's talking? It's me. Yeah. What, your thoughts? Oh, Jesus, no. What, you thought you could spend a full poem bashing me without me taking your focus away? Hey, I am so sorry, people. This is, uh, this is what I was just telling you about. Give me one second, okay? Hey, look, mind, I'm doing something important. This is a legacy conference. I need you to focus, okay? Now, when has that ever happened? Yo, I'm for real. Bro. I'm only focused when you're on Facebook, Snapchat, Netflix, and Xbox. I balance those like a tightrope on the checkbook. But when it's time to tip around and turn in homework, I turn off. Yeah, why do you do that, by the way? Well, you have a very serious condition that I've never told you about. It's called man brain. Man, boy, if you don't get out of here talking no, that I'm mess. I'm serious. It's the same thing that makes you know the whole Fresh Prince theme song, but blank on John 3.16. Oh, well, if that's the case, some of these girls have man brain, too, because, hey, look, that's not the point. Look, you're distracting me. I need you to go away. I can't. Oh, this dude. Me and you are connected like ghettos and liquor stores. Everywhere you go, I pop up, and we ain't been sober since birth. See, minds don't get enough credit. We're the ones who have to sort out all the phoniness and hypocrisy. Hey, what are you talking about, man? I am not phony, okay? <laughs> Easy example. Look, you don't want to be rude, but somebody's talking. Your face acts like you're interested oh. when your mind is comparing their breath to walking dead. I find it amazing how you speak in holy English, but you think in cuss Oh, whoa, hey, hey, hey. That's enough. That's enough. Why? Your secret's safe with me. I'm, Look, I'm the sanctuary that holds the sin you don't confess. I bear the weight of the real you and wash the walls that you put up so people think you're perfect. I'm an introvert's best friend, too. That inside savage folks don't think you have is had with me. Okay, look, stop it. You make it sound like we're cool, but you betray me at every thought. Terrorist attack in my imagination until my faith flies at half mass. You stage demonstrations to protest all things pure. Bad thoughts picket sign the streets of my dreams till my flesh riots. This, this isn't even a conversation, y'all. This is a sit-in from an angry batch of leftover daydreams who play monsters is a bad idea is to get attention. You are godless. I gotta, I gotta read my Bible to, to clean you. Yeesh, a healthy biblical diet? Yes. How about I help you stay on biblical fast food? Oh, why? So I can get fat off junk? What? No, 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 no. So we can consume sin uh, too and not get sick. See, I know how much conviction conflicts us. So if you stay in your word less, then I know less. The less I know, the more I doubt, and the more I doubt, the less obligated we'll feel to stop sinning. So I'll send signals to your hand to check your Twitter instead of your Bible and let you coast along conviction-free, okay? Bro, no, okay? Ooh. Ooh.
Hey, your breath so hot it makes Mike's feet bad. Hey, hey, <laughs> shut up, okay? Yo, your breath smell like the rapture happened on Thanksgiving what? and everybody just left their food Yo, what out. is he talking? Oh, I hate that I'm so scatterbrained. Look, he's doing it again, y'all. Taking my train of thought and, and derailing it. I can't stand you. I hate to tell you this, but your train of thought was never on track to begin with. What? Your train of thought turns into a roller coaster with that twisted sense of humor that we enjoy. Finding funny in the foulest and pleasure in the profane. Hey, does God like all the things we think of? Oh, you're so sick. Yeah, I have no immune system. Okay, I'll admit. <laughs> My entertainment sometimes enjoys the ungodly and pokes a hole in my holiness, but not anymore. Through this mob of crowded thoughts, I'll climb a tree to get to Jesus like Zacchaeus if I need to. I gotta put you in the past where you belong. The past? Yes, because... <gasps> the past? Oh, no, 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 no. We're not thinking about the past. No, no, not anymore, okay? Yeah, why not? Because I'm a child of God and not a child of Israel. I'm not trying to boomerang back to Egypt and be a slave again. And you, you can't turn us back. Bro, nobody said anything about turning back. But what's a little visit in your mind every now and then? Hey, don't lie like it wasn't fun. Man, it wasn't, okay? Oh. I know you hop in cars with strange memories and bum rides to familiar That's, places. No. In the hotel hearts of your exes, you wonder if you're still checked in sometimes. Hey, uh, Keeping receipts of canceled uh, reservations uh, despite new renovations, and that's okay. Hey, shut up. Shut up. I'm tired. You were pissing me off in front of the Legacy Conference. We were just at workshops. Look, y'all like how I got this mouth in my hand right mm -hmm. now? That's crazy. <sighs> Look, man. That's what I've been meaning to talk to you about anyway. I don't, I don't enjoy you anymore. You used to be my only way to understand the world around me, but now you're a habit. Well, I want to get rid of you. What? You breaking up with me? Look, only my bad thoughts. It's just that I can't trust whether you would follow the God that made you or the flesh that you're inside of. How you gonna get rid of me? Well, I was thinking I was gonna start by... How you gonna get rid of me after everything I held for you? Yeah, but you weren't supposed to have control in the first place. You were supposed to be dedicated like a child to our father. So when I'm gonna I do- I'm nothing but a friend to you. Yo, but you haven't. I gotta defy you just to stay in my word. Look, I know that you're mad, but this is the way the things happen. Mad. I hold everything for you. You forget, I can keep you happy, preoccupied, or horrified at the drop of a hat. You better keep me as is, cause I could put you through war to change me if you try. Yo, but it's war to keep you too. You're like a firework accident, beautiful but deadly. Left to your own devices, you're as eager as the gun that fills the hate in the hand that holds it. You unload insanity and I can't have you in my house any longer. Ha. How am I that bad? Yo, it's me, letting you relearn the things I promised God I'd unlearn. Procrastinating every opportunity to grow in faith and action. I am tired, the same way zoo animals feel when they bump up against the glass. You never let me break through. You question the possibility of me being who God calls me to be so much, sometimes I believe your doubts more than his voice. I doubt life and we, we seek death, ignoring a million good things to focus on the one bad when I let you run wild. We crash hard. Not true. We only crash because you don't know how to stay in your lane. I question who you are because you do. You're so discontent that you transform us to a scratch record. Playing different things depending on who you bump into. No. You, you want to get rid of me? It's probably because you care about other people's thoughts about you more than your hey, own. Hey, now you know that's not true because... You want to be liked so much that you prostitute our personality. Switching how we act to fit whatever group you find yourself Listen, in. I a color changing chameleon that morphs to fit the Crowd. Okay, I need hey, you to calm no down. No wonder why I'm not working top notch. I'm dealing with trying to process your insecurities and keep us both not insane. Well, my skeletons ain't staying in you. You gotta go with them. What? You don't think this weight is heavy on me?
I hold your secrets. Oh, no. You don't think that's heavy on me? What, you don't think it's heavy on me? You, you don't, don't think it's heavy on me? You I made me believe I'm yeah, Edward Scissorhands. I cut, cut everything I touch. I'm you dark for months like the North Pole. No sign of light or life inside of me. You I'm made my face have one foot in the grave and another in a banana peel. You I told me you I was nothing and had me believe it. If I wanted to, I could find hallways full of lies where we walk hand in hand together till we're lost. Till temptation twitches between my trembling temples like tremors in an earthquake. You hate me. When God's fingernail scratches the sky to create oh. rainbows, I'll convince you it's science. I, I'll have you approach your faith with stupid sleep. You want the superstition if you Okay, I had enough. Hey, listen, stop talking. It's my turn now. If you want to be friends, then how about having your mind be your worst enemy? I'll get your sin sickness stuck I, in your head like a song. Hey, cover your ears. Okay, listen, I'll keep you up at night. Make the sun a rotten apple. You're I can't, afraid to take a bite of it. Try and change me. Look, it's not I my need you to stop. The streets in your dreams. You're driving me insane. Bad. I'm a I can't of my take it anymore. Dead Please, stitches stop. From my heart like dirty stop. 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 I'll admit, I thought my thoughts were a free ride. The one place I could let sin roam and not get caught. I thought that I was free to act perfect, but think whatever. But hypocrisy isn't always doing the opposite of what you say. Sometimes it's thinking it. And if I'm honest, I've entertained thoughts like guests in my living room, believing it's just me and them, and that together we keep secrets that nobody would ever be able to discover. And if I choose to slap box this big, bold, Mayweather-shaped mess of a mind by myself, I'll mess up every time. My willpower is no match for the sin in my skin. My only hope to switch my tune is from the God who can change the tempo of a beating heart until it matches the rhythm of his will. And for all those times in pride, I tried to control my mind. My mind ended up controlling me. Pride tells us that we're in charge of things that we never had a handle on, like the thought that God could only take care of our lungs and veins and spiritual strength, but our mental health is up to us to say that God saves us, but up here does not change us. It's a lie. The God who is making all things new does so with minds too. And if his spirit found a house inside of you, then it is working. It's just up to us to offer up our hearts of stone to the God who gives that spirit, working out our salvation with fear and trembling while casting every thought out that presents itself against his glory. It's called... It's called a good fight for a reason. Lift weights in your word and only let your guard drop for God's guidance, knowing that as soon as you were saved, the renewing of your mind is started. Don't let anything take that from you. What God started in you, continue.